All right, guys, here is a fun project for you to try. You do need a camera phone or you could get creative and head outside with the computer and try to use the webcam. It's up to you. I want you to take a picture of something from nature. Be creative. Try lots of different things. Then you're going to go to this website called tuxpi.com. That's T-U-X-P-I.com. Once you get there, you can do this from your phone or from your computer if you've got your Im image downloaded on your computer. You're going to hit this big blue button, start photo editing. And then you need to choose a picture. So I've already, mine uh, was already up here under this folder I created for Earth Day. I'm going to grab this picture right here. I just took a picture of some leaves and I kind of like this stemmy bud thing that's happening here. So I'm going to choose to open that picture. Once it opens, it'll be a big picture at the top of your screen. And I want you guys to create a kaleidoscope effect with this picture for a fun sort of um, mandala Earth Day type of nature thing. I'm scrolling down here. There's lots of effects you can add to your photographs, but we're going to get down to the bottom here where it says photo montages, fun and art and click this one. It says kaleidoscope. The program is automatically going to decide how to kaleidoscope affect your photograph. So it took my photograph and created this, and that's pretty much it. You have options over here on the left. I'm sure you could keep adding effects. You can also adjust the kaleidoscope effect right here. Wedges is basically how many pieces, how many triangles it created. It created five. Let's change it to eight and let's see what it looks like. And now it's much more detailed. So it's up to you play around with that. When you're happy with it, you could share it. This will, if you hit this button, it will take you right to a social media type of website. That does not help me. To get your credit, you're gonna hit the save button. You need to save that file and wherever it gets saved to on your computer or on your phone, you may have your gallery, you could have it on the desktop, it just depends. Then you're gonna choose that image and send it to me for some extra credit points. If you weren't happy with this picture and you're like, gosh, I'm gonna go take something different, go ahead and do that. You can from this screen right here where we left off, I could choose a different file. So this button right here, this big blue button says choose file. You're just gonna pick a different picture and go through the same exact process.